Hey friends, in this video, I'm walking you through three powerful features inside Kartra right now and exactly how to use them. First, the brand new checkout system. Then I'm gonna show you how to build a simple website inside Kartra and what Kartra offers right now in terms of AI. If you're new here, hi, I'm Louise. I help online business owners simplify their systems and build a successful online business around their expertise. So if that's you, hit subscribe. Let's start with one of the biggest updates Kartra has made recently, the new checkout system. The major benefits of this are that it's an optimized faster checkout, especially for mobile, and includes new payment options such as Apple Pay, Google Pay, and buy now, pay later options like Klarna and Afterpay, which gives your customers more ways to pay and faster. And if you're wanting to use Kartra in your business, click the link in the description below to get my free Kartra roadmap, which will help you set it up the right way. So here's how to set it up. The first thing you need to do is set up a Stripe account in order for this to work, and you need to make sure it's connected under your integrations in Kartra. So just click on settings, integrations, and make sure that Stripe is connected. Then in Stripe, you need to navigate to Payments and then Payment Methods and go into your Kartra configuration. From here, you're going to see all the different payment options that are available to you and you want to turn them on. So as you can see, Apple Pay is turned on here, Google Pay and Klarna. Okay, and then there will be other options for you depending on where you're located that you could turn on. And then in terms of getting those payment processors set up, that's all you have to do, so easy. And now we're going to go into Kartra and actually set up the checkout page. Okay, so in Kartra, you're going to click on sales, then checkouts. And this is where all your new checkouts will live. So let's click on create new checkout. Then you're going to title this with the name of your product. So let's say that I wanted to do this for a coaching call. I'm going to title it that and then choose my coaching call product. Okay, great. Then I'd recommend keeping this selected. And then you'll see your different types of checkouts here. So you can do a Kartra hosted page, you can do a pop-up checkout or an embedded checkout. But I'm gonna demo just creating a nice and simple checkout page that is Kartra hosted. So as you can see, you have different options in terms of display. So you can check these out and see which one you like best. I really like this one right here at the top. So I'm gonna hit create, and then you can see exactly what that will look like. Okay, so it has your product information on the left side, and then it asks them for their contact information and walks them through the purchase process. So if you click change up here, you'll see that this is where you can customize it and you can change it to your brand colors. So that's why mine's already yellow. <laughs> okay, and then you can choose if you want to display your brand logo at the top of the page. I'm keeping that off. And then if you go over to payment, this is where we need to make sure that your Stripe account is connected. So click change, and then you're going to change your credit card payment gateway to your actual Stripe account. Okay, hit save, and then you want to turn demo mode off and publish this. So now let me show you what that looks like. Okay, great. So it's a really nice and clean checkout page, and then your customer will just need to fill in their information. And now they will see those updated payment options. So for example, I now have my credit card options here and Google Pay since I'm in Panama, but depending on where you're at in the world, you may see even more options. So super nice and clean, fast and easy to navigate. So for example, let's say I was in the United States, then now even more payment options are going to appear. So what is visible depends on the country that they are located in as well as the browser. But as long as you've turned on all those options, then you've done what you need to do. Next, let's talk about building your website in Kartra. So yes, you can absolutely build a simple website in Kartra, but if you want to create a full blog or need advanced SEO features, I recommend that you use Squarespace for that part and use Kartra for all of your sales and marketing pages. But for many coaches, course creators, and service providers, a simple website is all they want, especially when just getting started. So here's how you can set one up. All right, so you're going to build a series of pages in Kartra and then link them together. So I suggest that you start with your home page. So go into pages and then click create a new page. Okay, so I'm just gonna title this home. And super important, in order for this to work, you have to create a site. So you're gonna click manage site and type in website and make sure to include this page. 
Okay, so that's super important. And you're going to think of your homepage as your base. So click add and then done. And I'm going to choose the page type of personal branding. Okay, cool. So now you can go through the templates here and see which one you like best. Okay, so let's say this one. I'm going to select that. Hit create. All right, cool. And this is going to give you a good starting point for your homepage. Okay, great. So I'd go up here, place this image with my logo, resize that however you need. And everything about cartoon page builder is where you can just click and make edits so for example i can come in here change this out as my name okay we're not gonna worry about the content for now okay so i'm just gonna quickly change out this image to one of me all right cool okay so hopefully you see just how easy it is to customize that but what we need to focus on for your website is making sure that the pages link together so Across the top here, you want to decide what these links are going to be. So we have home, about, my works, for example. You might want to change that to instead say something like work with me. Okay, so I'm going to change the text for those. Maybe I don't need a services page, so I'm going to delete that. Contact, okay, and if you want to change the button, you totally can. Okay, so decide what you want this top bar to be. So then what you're going to do is click Sites, and then you're going to determine what is going to be shared across all the pages in your website. So for example, I want to share the header menu and the footer. Okay, and I'm going to apply this to all pages that have been grouped together as websites. Okay, so I'm going to hit apply, proceed. So now let's say that I want to add another page to that site. I can click the plus sign on page. Let's say I want to make an about page now. I'm going to make it about. I'm going to choose the site of website. And just for demo purposes, I'm going to start with a blank page. Now I'm going to go back into my home page, click sites, and I'm going to turn on what I want to share with the other pages in the website. So I'm going to turn on header menu and footer. I'm going to apply this to all pages. Hit apply, proceed. Then I'm going to publish this live and go back into my about page. And then as you can see, it has added the header to the top and the footer to the bottom. So this is how it will function as a full website. So think of your homepage as your base website where you make the edits here and then you just publish it to the other pages in your website. So for example, I need to make sure that this about link here actually links to the about page. So I'm going to click on the pencil icon, go to link, link to another page, link to a Kartra page under my website, find that about page and hit apply. Okay, cool. So now if I publish that live, you'll see that we have our core website here. And if somebody clicks on the about link, it's going to go to that about page. That's how you create a simple website in Kartra and make sure that everything is linked all together. Now, if you're wondering how to customize the page links, like what that looks like, all you have to do is click this link icon icon right here, get the page link, and then you can customize your link here. So if I click on the pencil icon, I can choose my custom domain, and then I can just type in what I want that page link to be. Finally, let's explore how to use Kartra's AI tools. So you can use AI anytime you are writing emails, SMS messages, or creating pages to make your copywriting and page building faster and easier. So the first thing you want to do is adjust your AI business settings. So you're going to go into your account settings and then you're going to see AI business settings. Click change and then you're going to enter info here on what products and services you offer, who your customer base is and how you would describe your business. Now anytime that you go to create a page, so let's say that I just needed to create a landing page. Okay, so here's the starter template. But what I can do is go over here to the left sidebar, click AI, and now I can explain exactly what content I need. Okay, so I put in a bit of basic information here, but the more that you put in, the better. Okay, so I'm going to click use Kartra AI. Okay, cool. So let's review what it came up with. Okay, that's a cool starting point. And then you can enter in here to rewrite or change any details that you need. I do have to note that the AI uses are limited, so just double check how many you have. It will show you right here at the bottom based on your plan, and that's per month. Okay, so then at this point, you know, obviously the text size just needs to be changed, so I could quickly come in here and I could just do that easily. So even if it doesn't look perfect at first, you can of course come in here and customize absolutely everything about this page. So that's how it works in the page builder, but you can also do this in emails and SMS messages. Okay, so here's a plain text email that I have. Okay, so I'm just gonna click 
edit message. Then again, I can go to the left sidebar and click generate with AI. Then that same pop-up is going to appear and I'm going to be able to generate email content. And down here is where you can toggle on and off if you want Kartra to use your business settings that you filled in. Awesome. So it's going to enter in that content down here and then you can ask it to refine it. So pretty cool. I love the fact that it's been worked in. All right. So that's how to set up the new checkout system to boost your conversions, how to set up a simple streamlined website and how to leverage Kartra's AI tools. If you're ready to give Kartra a try, click the link in the description below where you can get a free 30 day trial to test it out for yourself. If you have any questions at all, let me know in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video was super valuable for you and I'll see you real soon with the next one. Bye.